spend yourself silly in the 2018 Mercedes C-Class, if you like, or conserve cash with well-equipped base models The Mercedes-Benz C-Class comes in a sometimes bewildering array of models, but we'll break it down for you like this. Sedan, coupe or convertible each comes with a choice of turbo 4, turbo V6, or turbo V8 engines, rear or all-wheel drive and each comes with an automatic transmission beyond the dazzling display of niche marketing firepower. The C-Class also has an excellent set of standard and optional features, and great customization potential. Its infotainment system puzzles us, and its 4-year-50,000 mile warranty is solid, but outdone by rivals prices range from about $41,000 for a C300 sedan to more than $82,000 for an AMG C63S convertible all versions get a minimum level of standard equipment that suits the price and prestige levels those features include cruise control, power features, a power driver seat, a rear view camera, a 7.0 inch display with touchpad based infotainment control, Bluetooth with audio streaming, and a USB port sedans and coupes also get a sunroof, and two doors get 18 inch wheels and wood trim. The options list jumps from leather, synthetic leather is standard on base models, to a power passenger seat, to navigation and an 8.4 inch display, to LED headlights, to a head-up display, even an in-car fragrance dispenser like the one found on the S-Class cars the custom dress kits include Napa leather, sport seats, AMG style wheels and bodywork, and choice of metal, leather, and wood trim infotainment and technology A smartphone integration kit leads off the infotainment wave in the C-Class, but most cars will come with the common user interface. It stitches together the radio, smartphone, and navigation functions and displays them on a bright dash-mounted, non-touchscreen display the system accepts inputs by voice, steering wheel controls, or the console-mounted, touch-sensitive control pad the touch interface just can't match the integration of a touchscreen it doesn't scroll smoothly, offers too many command paths with too many steps, and doesn't have the effective input of a similar setup, like Audi's MMI the balm for this wound is a stunning Burmester sound system. It's an expensive option but comes with cut metal speaker screens and symphonic sound with crisp highs and resonant lows.